Alright, so I've been doing this for... I, I played this run last night, and I got it going, right? This is Risk of Rain 2, by the way. I bought it a few days ago, and I just can't stop playing it. It is really fun. But, uh... I think I may have broken the game to the point where it doesn't know what to do. Um, I don't even, like, remotely need to fire anymore. Like, I stand next to things if things die. Um, it's gotten to the point where boss events don't last more than two seconds. If they do, then the boss is behind something, and I can't get to it. I just stand still and things die. It's kind of ridiculous, and I thought I might show the final loop here, um, because originally this challenge was supposed to go to stage 100, but seeing as the whole, you know, 40 to 45 was lacking, per, per se, it was only one enemy type for the majority of it, I figured that I'll just stop at 50, so, you know, here's the final loop, um, I figured I'd, you know, might as well record it, and who knows, maybe I'll do this with other characters too, but, uh, I just want to show what this looks like. I, I, if I sprint, it's hard for me to... Here we go. The the only enemies that spawn now are uh, scavengers. Those are the only enemies that really spawn now. I don't really need to pick up items anymore. It's gotten to this point. It got to that point. Um, again, scavengers are the only thing that really spawn. After 40, it looks like. Uh, where's the teleporter? Where is the teleporter? There it is, it's over there. I do have rusty keys, but I'm not gonna use them. I just wanna get this over with. So, here's the boss event. This is what the boss event looks like. Stone Titans? What's Stone Titans? This is what it looks. That's just what it looks. This is just what it looks like. And by the way, the frame drops are not because of OBS. No, the the frame drops are actually dropping in game. Um, the full forty to forty five loop was just nothing but scavengers as the bosses. So you know. Um, as well as that, almost every single enemy I fight now is an elite, um, and almost every single enemy is either a Celestine or Urchin, as you can very clearly see on the side. Some are Blazing, but most are just Celestine, or, um, Malachite. I don't know how to say it. So, this is all, this is what it's devolved into. Um... This is without Survivors of the Void active, um, simply because, um, at least when this video is, was made, it's too, I want to say, I don't want to say hard, but it's too buggy, Survivors of the Void. At least when this video was made, I don't know if they pushed the patch or not, but uh, th it's too buggy when this video was made, um, so, you know. Let's, let's get this over with. Um, I'd rather not play Survivors of the Void until, you know, all the bugs have been patched and all that stuff. And it's and it's actually a fair, fun DLC. Because um, while it is fun, don't get me wrong, it's unfair. There's so many one-shots and, like, so much shit that does, like, 99% of your health. Uh, where is it? It's over there. At this point, I just want to get this over with. I mean, like... I can't play any other games with Risk of Rain 2 active, so... Oh, yeah, here we go. Here's with the um, scavengers that just disappeared. Again, I, I'm, I'm not firing. I'm just standing still. And um, you may notice my money situation does kind of overflow into the negatives which is not you 
That is legitimately happening. Um, I've broken this game to the point where it's not fun. And I say that with a heavy heart, because I love this game. I do. And I'm still going to play it after this, but, uh... Yeah. <laughs> I don't really know what that to say. Um, I am going to do this in Survivors of the Void as well, once the patch gets pushed. But, uh, until then... I think I'm just going to, like, play regular. Um, I have 30 copies of a few items. Um, Tri-Tip Dagger is 30 copies. Um, Crowbar's 30 copies. Paul's Goat Hoof is 30 copies. I have 10 scrap because I was hoping to hold out for a soldier syringe. 30 cop, um, 3D printer. 3D copy, you're listening to me. But, like, this is, like, no enemies have spawned. I've broken the game to the point where things just don't spawn anymore. Like, And honestly, I don't think the devs intended for it to get this out of hand. <laughs> uh, where is it? Hi, sir. How's it going? You see what I mean? I don't even need to fire anymore. I'll pick up the items. What not? Why not? Um, the scavengers are def definitely made this run. Out, like turned it from out of hand to to um to basically the game is broken i'm pretty sure i've broken it and <laughs> i didn't know that i could break risk of rain 2 like this but very few enemies spawn like I'll, I'll like i could just like hang out if i really wanted to but i'd rather get this over with Oh, the Imp Overlords. Look at that. But, um, yes, I do have a video coming out. Um, it's definitely going to be a little different from my other videos, but I hope that y'all will enjoy it. This is sort of impromptu upload. Mainly because I haven't uploaded something in a while. And because I've mainly had, like, no motivation to upload that stuff lately. So... I gotta admit, the soundtrack for this game is really fucking banger, though. Well, as you can see on the left side, uh, I only see two urchins and one imp overlord. Three urchins, actually. That are, you know, turned to my side. The rest are just Celestine and Malachite scavengers. You know. Um... Oh boy, that was a pretty decent frame drop. And yes, um, I do have 20k HP at the moment. I don't question this anymore. Um, the money's in the negatives again. I'm just going to say that I love this game. I'm not going to stop playing it. But uh, I broke it. <laughs> I break everything I touch, essentially. Um, I'm not really sure how to, quote, obliterate, but, um, after I finish the fifth, the, um, uh, round 50, I'll pause the recording, and, you know, I'll do things. I do want to open this legendary chest, though. Um, speaking of legendary chests, I have actually learned more locations of legendary chests using this little radar scanner thing here. Um, I've noticed that at least on this... On this, on this stage, it only has one place to spawn, which is right there. It's sitting at 5 million, almost 6 million, huh? Um, but yeah, you can kind of see. There's no enemies at all, whatsoever. And I could just, like, you know, run around, do my thing. The only thing that appears is scavengers every now and then. I haven't used a mine in a while. Let's see what that does. Oh, that doesn't do much at all. And somehow he died. I don't know. Um, like, I can't use a sh like, I want to use a shrine of bl not blood. Um, combat. I haven't seen a shrine of combat 
in, I want to say, a good 20 to 25 stages. So, we're just going to do the boss. Um, again, at this stage, you'd think I would be swarmed with enemies. When, really, there is no enemies anymore. I think I've killed them all. So, let's do the teleporter. And yes, that was 13 million HP that dropped in the blink of an eye. Um, I'm hoping I can get that. Oh yeah, no, I can get, definitely get that legendary. It's 5 million, not 500 million. I'm dumb. But uh, this is what it looks like. This is what Risk of Rain looks like when the game's maxed out and doesn't know what to do. Oh boy. Integer overflowed. It's overflowed. There they go again. Oh, we have some titans that just, just the fuck appeared. Again, I'm not sure what's happening at this point. Like, I don't even need to move. Like, I just. Oh, wait, that's right. I can't do that with the teleporter of an active. I'm dumb. Um, I'm hoping that I'm not stuck in negative money when the teleporter finishes. Because I would like to open that legendary chest. But, you know. It's... I'm not sure what he's firing at over there. Probably a scavenger. Yeah, it's a scavenger, I think. There we go. Yep, it's a scavenger. Um, I want to know what this oh, legendary is, though. Oh, hey, look at that. A new legendary! I haven't had the Ice Silver yet. Well, no, I, I have, I've I've had it on other runs, but I haven't had it on this run yet. But, um, here we go. Last, the final, the final Sky Meadow. Um, I'm not sure how to obliterate. But, um, I'll look it up. And then I'll, you know, do my thing. Um, things are costing millions, and as you can very clearly see, millions is no problem for me. Teleport is over there. I'm just not even going to fire anymore, like, I don't need to. I mean, like, why would I? <laughs> but, um, yeah. This is the 50 stage challenge. So. While this, um, I'm just going to let this play out. Uh, you know, I'm, oh, those souls control units. Cool. I'm just going to, like, let this go. But um, I can say with a certainty that I will still play this game. And I'll probably do this challenge with the characters too. But um, I have never seen... I've never broken a game. right? I've broken Isaac, obviously, so many times. But I have never broken a game to the point where there is no and more enemies. Where, you know, the only enemies that spawn are during the boss event. Um, you know, I've, I've never had it like that. I've never done that before. Which is, I gotta admit, it's kind of sad. My phone is being dumb. But, this game, I love it. I do. I'm still gonna play it. Um, I'm not sure if I have to fight Mithrix to obliterate. And if I have to fight Mithrix, I really don't want to do that. Because he's gonna yoink all of my items. And uh, I don't, I'm not sure I'll be able to survive that. <laughs> so, you know. All right.
I'm just doing my thing at this point. I don't really need to do anything besides just sit here. Teleporter event. Oh, the teleporter event's finished. Uh, yeah, enter the primordial teleporter. A distant roost, huh? Alright, so, um, this is what's gonna happen. I'm gonna pause the recording, right? I'm gonna see how to obliterate myself. And I'm gonna come back when I have a solution. So, you know, I'll, I'll be back, I, 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 I guess. I don't, I don't know. So I figured out how to obliterate myself. Um, I need to find, I want to, because I do have lunar coins, I'm going to pray to the shrine, there's a lunar pod, I'm, I'm okay, uh, where is it again, I forget, I don't like the distant roost, simply because, like, everything's, like, it's hard to find shit, uh, I don't think the newt altar spawns on this, on this version, oh wait, no, it just does, it's down here. Wow, that's really out of the way. Um, I'm hoping that I can get up here. There we go. I have to go to the teleporter. Wee! I'm over here now. Yeah, this is what I've turned into. Like, I'm just not even gonna touch anything. I'm not even gonna teleport. I'm not even gonna fire. Uh, what? Did the boss even spawn? The boss didn't even spawn! What are you doing over there, my guy? And it overflows again. Well, now wait. <laughs> um, apparently, I... Apparently, what happens is... I need to go into the Celestial Portal. Which, I'm not sure how to get to that. It says it appears on every third stage. But, uh, who knows, really. So I'm just gonna donate to the new altar every single time. And see what happens. But, uh, I'll meet you guys when the Celestial Portal appears. How about that? Alright. Here we are with the Celestial Portal. Um, I don't want to talk about the amount of uh, things around me right now. I just want to get this over with. I've had my fun. I've completed the challenge of uh, getting to stage 50, but I think it's about time that we end this the proper way. A moment fractured, huh? Never actually been here before. Oh. Like, I'm, I'm pretty sure I could just like, wee. Yep, there it is. Let's end this the proper way. Obliterate yourself from existence. Let's do it. Are you sure? Yes. Look at that. Jesus Christ. Look at the amount of items. I even had five extra lives. So, honestly, I'll take it. We completed the challenge. We beat 53 stages. We collected 63 billion gold. <laughs> Damage dealt. Oh my god. That's a lot of damage. 3 billion. Yeah, I, I didn't even die once. Highest level was 55. I collected almost 1,000 items. Jesus. It really does not look like 1,000 items. It really doesn't. But who knows? Maybe it is. I don't know. But that is the 50 stage challenge. Um, it's also to highlight a sort of issue about the game. 
about getting a really high up there, at least in the base game. For some reason, the game just doesn't spawn enemies anymore. And just spawns nothing but, um, whatever it's called. Uh, what are they called? Scavengers. Just spawns nothing but scavengers. But, uh, that's all. I just wanted to share this, this, uh, run with you guys. Because, uh, well, let's be honest. <laughs> a run like that. Just, ugh. It gets, it, it got out of hand really fast. But that is all. I'll see you in the next one.